Welcome to Informatica training videos. Today we will see how to configure an on-premise repository in IACS to make use of the source control feature. So we will see what are the licenses that are required and the configurations required at the org level and the individual user level settings. So to make use of on-premise repository you need two licenses one is source control the other one is git repo connect app underscore r1 this feature requires a separate service to control that the second license is needed you can reach out to the shipping team to get this license enabled so once you have the license what you'll have to do is you'll have to go to the secure agent group and go to the ad enable disable services additional services tab and choose this self-hosted git repo app so once this app is up and running you can go ahead and configure the repository if this service is not up and running you can go to the agent installation location and apps folder git repo connect app and then the logs directory and then see if there are any errors that you can fix it in the UI um, uh, enable source control checkbox and if it's uh, development org enable this allow push to git repository and in the drop down choose on premise and provide the git repository URL and choose the runtime environment where this service is running and you can authenticate via the git user and personal access token and similar setting needs to be done at the individual user level as well let's see that on a demo once you log in into the IICS UI go to the administrator page and then the settings tab and then um, click this pencil icon enable source control and this is a dev org so enable the push option and choose the platform as on promise and provide the git repository URL I'm using GitLab, so I've given the GitLab URL and uh, choose the runtime environment where the service is running and uh, provide the username and the personal access token. So, if there are any authentication failures, you should be able to see in the logs on the service directory on the agent machine so now it's the configuration is done at the agent side um, let me do it on the individual user as well okay yeah so that's it so um, the settings for this particular user is done so you should be able to make use of the source control features. If you have uh, any suggestions, please reach out to this email IDs. Thank you.